no, um, you know, very smooth in the car, unlike uh, the 153 car, which doesn't seem to be uh, as smooth as, as we can see on the screen there. That is the BMW of Guy Stewart 15 SP3. This might bring out another uh, Accord 60. Just we'll keep an eye on that for a moment as in comes the Lapidus McLaren without a front wheel. Again, another wheel problem for the 17 car. Oh, no, it is. Is it there? It's sitting right down. Damage at the back, but it is all the wheels as the BMW gets going again. And that was a very odd accident. That's a strange a place to be going off. I would suggest that something broke on that car. Ah, yes, look at the... No, was that cause or effect? Well, he went in left. frontward, so he went left rear. Yeah, I'm thinking he's got left rear suspension damage that's pitched that's him, thrown into, him the into the wall. Yeah. Would you go with that? I know nothing about motorsport, so um, I'll, go with, um, I'll go with what you're saying, John. You seem to know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh, only... Yeah, the blind leading the inept up here. Uh, just finishing off the thoughts on uh, GT Academy. It, uh, surely now it's got to be taken seriously, Darren, as a, as a genuine way of finding talent. And finding talent that, quite frankly, would never get into motorsport any other way. Uh, yes, I mean, we, you know, we, I've said it a number of times, so those that uh, listen to your commentary are probably bored of me saying it, but at the end of the day, you know, uh, the people involved in this animal sport are fans. Uh, we are enthusiasts for motorsport, and one of the things that uh, we, we don't like, I don't think any of us like that know what's happening, is the way that young talent is coming through the ranks and, and that people are getting up to um, the higher echelons of motorsport. And we're just providing another way. You know, if you, you ask somebody for a budget in karting these days, national karting, forget even European karting, um, the average man on the street definitely, definitely can't afford to do that. So, therefore, the pool of um, uh, people that you're choosing from to find your best racing drivers is smaller. And this esteemed colleague on my right here gave me.